One of the members of the 1st SS Infantry Brigade at the time was Hans Friedrich. He claims not to recall exactly which actions he took part in that summer, but he does admit to participating in killings like the one in Ostrog. They were so utterly shocked and frightened. You could do with them what you wanted. Men, women and children were ordered to strip and prepare to die. Try to imagine there is a ditch with people on one side and behind them soldiers. That was us and we were shooting. And those who were hit fell down into the ditch. Could you tell me what you were thinking and feeling when you were shooting? Nothing. I only thought, aim carefully, so that you hit properly. That was my thought. This was your only thought. During all that time, you had no feelings for the people, the Jewish civilians that you shot? No. And why not? Because my hatred towards the Jews is too great. And I admit my thinking on this point is unjust. I admit this. Aber but what I experienced from my earliest youth, when I was living on a farm, what the Jews were doing to us, well, that will never change. That is my unshakable conviction. As he grew up in the 1930s in an atmosphere of vicious anti-Semitism, Hans Friedrich came to believe that local Jewish traders had cheated him and his family. What in God's name did the people you shot have to do with those people who supposedly treated you badly at home? They simply belonged to the same group. What else? What else did they have to do with it? Nothing. But to us, they were Jews. There were connections between Jews and Bolsheviks. There was sufficient evidence for the fact that there were connections between the two. The Nazis spouted any number of similar prejudices about the Jews, even claiming there was an international Jewish conspiracy against them and that the Jews had somehow lost Germany the First World War. Their delusions knew no bounds. Das sind jene Ostjudentypen, die besonders nach dem Weltkriege die Großstädte Mittel- und Westeuropas überschwemmten wo sie als Parasiten ihre Gastvölker zersetzten und tausendjährige Kulturen zu vernichten drohten. Wo sie auch auftauchten, brachten sie Verbrechen, Korruption und Chaos mit sich. <lacht> 